the platinum alligator gar was not the only fish that this person stole. But check it out, guys. Check it out. Let's catch them all with Catch Em All Fishing with Zach Ketchum. Well, guys, I'm back. Back in town. I have good news. I have bad news. But I actually have a lot of bad news. But let's start with the good news, guys. Check out these tanks all cycled in. Oh my God. So we have our canister filter for our big 75 gallon. We have our canister filter for our solid 50 gallon tank. These are all cycled. These are 100% ready to go. I just threw a couple of test strips in there and they are pristine, perfect, ready to go, fish ready. So what I'm gonna do is go get one of the fish for the bottom one. I'm still gonna leave this open because Part of the bad news is why this is going to be empty for a little bit longer. All right, guys, we just gotta get our tilapia. It's awesome thawing out because we got some hungry pets, guys. You know, we got my soft sign shoes. Let's get it. Ah. Beautiful girl, can you help me out with the camera? All right, guys, so we have, like I said, good news and bad news. Come on, come on. We actually have a couple fish missing. I know I've been out of town, we've been in Louisiana. I have some. Fire vids for you guys. I'm talking back to back to back fire vids. Crazy stuff that we haven't had on this channel in a long time and that I have never caught in my entire life. Giants. But anyway, I went out of town for that to get you guys some awesome footage. And if you look around in here, check it out guys, check it out. Hold on. Let me let me give you a quick walkthrough. If you can see, there is no albino alligator gar at all and hey hello guys what's up at least the babies look nice look they're all growing what's up little babies you got babies and big boys all the bigger ones are like hiding under there I think they get darker in color like the bigger they get because these are like the baby the first round of babies these mid-sized ones are the first round of babies and the bigger ones are like all hiding going to there in the grass uh, one good thing is that Mini Moo did survive. Mini Moo is in there, but uh, the guard didn't have the chance to eat Mini Moo. Mini Moo got in the bottom pond somehow. So I have no idea how that happened, but I do know that someone stole our platinum alligator gar. But before we get more into that, let's feed our fish really quick because it's been a long time since I've done it. The platinum alligator gar was not the only fish that this person stole, but check it out, guys. Check it out. Get up in here. Oh, hi, right, babies. You miss me? It's crazy to see everyone like this because it's almost like they actually miss me because my mother was feeding them while I was out of town and so was Catchman Girl. And it's just, <laughs> it's crazy how they all come up. Hi, gays. Hi, babies. How are you doing? But anyway, let's feed them really quick. All right, we have all the babies over here. Check them out. Check them out. Let's get Shamu his big old snack first. It's not drop there. Put that down. Get Shamu. Good Shamu. Good big girl. Go ahead. <laughs> that always cheers me up. Everyone's going nuts. Everyone's going nuts. Come on. Here you go. Here you go, Beans. Here you go. Yeah. Oh, that is beans. That's not ketchup. Look how significantly they've all grown. Guys, look how crystal clear this water is. Everyone's doing great. Look at the little pops going back and forth. Look at them going crazy. Look, watch. I took that in. They're going to go destroy it. Look at them. Boom. Boom. <laughs> Crazy, right? So these are the little pocket that I've obviously caught in that last episode. I think that was the last one I posted. Oh, they're eating really well. The same day that I actually put these guys in here, they already started eating, which is amazing. Pocket are just such such voracious predators. This is insane, right? Catch up. Here you go. How you doing, big guy? No? Not hungry? These guys would not eat for a while. That same day that guy came and messed with the gar, he must have came in here and messed with everybody because they wouldn't eat. My mother said that these guys were all scared and shy and not even Shamu would come up and eat. And as we all know, Shamu is like a monster and so are these little Pafu, but it's just crazy, man, that someone would come out here and do this. Like, I'm not really surprised because it was an expensive fish, but I'm surprised since it was a live animal. Like. Why would you be so stupid to grab a live animal? What are you going to do, sell the live animal? Like, if, if it's sold, we're going to catch you. Everyone knows about that platinum gar. Like, everyone. So, I guess if you, like, really, really want a pet fish, like, like you want a pet fish that bad that you're going to steal it from someone, 
Like how low of a human being are you? It's so whack. Like it's like stealing someone's dog. So stupid. But anyway, that like I said, that's not the only fish that they stole. Beautiful. Can you pass me the pellets really quick? I forgot to feed the um the jack. Here, baby. Hey, baby. Oh, yum, yum. You're getting so big. It's crazy because beans was not getting that big that fast. I mean, yeah, it's really warm water, and like I said, it's highly circulated. We got that pump right there, and that pump is filling this thing with fresh water from the lake. But my goodness, like, it seems like now that he's competing with the other two catfish, like, he's growing so fast. Especially those two Paku, those things are just ridiculous. Perfect. <laughs> Don't fall. Yeah, go ahead. Feed that guy. How you doing, buddy? How you doing? Oh, I love seeing that. Go ahead. No one else wants to eat? Are you guys being so soft? Steve, when people mess with your fish, you can tell they like have an attitude change. Like these guys are all being like finicky. Ketchup normally just comes up to eat. Even when he's not really hungry, he'll still come up, you know? Like he's coming up right now, but he's still a little pissed. He's like shy. He feels like, oh, maybe whoever you are, it might not really be you. You might be like scooping him around with a net. Like they're used to me cleaning this stuff out because I cleaned the gunk out with a, with a pool net to make sure like any of the extra debris and leaves and branches that fall in get scooped up. But I mean, they know when someone's out there messing with them. And my fish are definitely acting pretty stupid. At least Shamu is better, you know? Shamu is pretty hardy. Last time someone picked her up and dropped her and then the next day she was eating, so. <laughs> these fish are awesome. You just fed these little guys? I did. Nice. Hey, what's up? Look at them having a party. What's up, guys? Look how big they've gotten. That thing is like a goldfish. Oh my god, I know you're looking at me, I'm looking at you, buddy. Freaking massive. The big ones are massive. Big old breeders, but yeah, guys. So we no longer have our alligator gar in our bottom pond at all. And like I said, they did steal something else. And if you could have guessed it, which you all probably did, while I was setting up the tanks inside to keep that flower horn inside, now we're missing that as well. I just lifted this up. My mother didn't lift this up at all, but she didn't know about it. But I just found out that the flower horn is no longer here. Yes, it's gone. We still do have our gulper catfish, and we're going to keep him inside. What's up, Shamu? Should have eaten that guy, man. What I got you around for? You're supposed to eat everyone that comes around. Come on, man. You guys got to do, like, teamwork. Next time someone comes around, jump out, eat them, and then take care of them, you know? Come on. Yeah, the Paku, you guys, are, the red tails are big enough to hold them down while you sw swallow them down. Come on, man. There's a lot of plants like these all dried up and pulled out. Um, so, I mean, you can tell that someone was messing around in here. They, I think what they did is they just scooped that thing up, honestly, and they probably couldn't even see what they were doing. I um, don't think they had any lights or else they would have been caught. But I think they just scooped that thing and just had like a bunch of weeds in the gar in the net and then they just like took off or something. You guys eating well? Alright, well, guys it could have been worse. I mean honestly, stuff happens, but uh, you, can't, you can't stop stupid people from doing stupid things. Like, he's gonna get caught, you know? Something's gonna come back at him. I strongly believe in that karma, like you do one to others as you want them to do to you and that's why I'm always friendly, I always try to help everybody out, but stupid things happen um, when you let them happen, you know, like this should have been uh, better guarded, obviously, obviously I thought that I'd be able to have that tank cycle and get this flower horn in a safer environment, um, but guys, <laughs> As soon as I gave the opportunity, the opportunity was taken. They stole the fish. Um, they must have been really aggressive fish keepers. You know, you do what you gotta do if you're desperate and desperate people do desperate things. It's an unfortunate situation. Um, especially that guard, that guard was so cool, man. But, uh, whatever, I don't, I don't know what to say. Uh, yeah, I, I'm just I'm just at a loss for words at how stupid this is. That's grand theft. That gar is worth a decent amount of money, and so is this guy right here, so uh, it's grand theft. When the guy is caught, unless he does somehow bring the gar back, uh, that is grand theft. And I'm thinking about offering a reward 
for whoever finds the gar. You know, let's just do that. Whoever finds the gar and knows about this gar, I'm gonna give a $2,000 reward to. Whoever has any hint, whoever figures this stuff out, um, I'm gonna leave a post on my Instagram, Catch Em All Fishing, the same as my YouTube channel. And uh, comment if you know, uh, send a message, a direct message to Joey Slam with words, <laughs> as well as a picture, if you have any picture evidence. Um, if you see the agar being sold online, especially with bite marks on the fins, um, then for sure that's the gar. The gar is about this big, so I would say about 20, 23 inches. Um, and if you have any knowledge of this at all, let me know. And uh, we'll give you a $2,000 reward if we get that fish back. If you did steal a fish and you're feeling like, oh, if I get caught, I'm afraid, just bring the fish back, bro. Like, honestly, it's stupid. It, what you did, it's, it's, it's a dumb thing. And I understand if you're a kid or you're an adult, stop for saying this. If you do have the gar and you're watching this video, just bring it back. Like, this is so stupid. Just bring it back. I won't press charges if you bring the fish back. And that's guaranteed on this video, written down. If you bring the fish back and it's A-OK, -okay, I will not press charges. Here's some clips of the gar if you guys, like, don't know what it looks like. This, like maybe this is the first time you're watching this video or watching this channel and you haven't subscribed yet. Here's some clips of this gar, me hand feeding it and uh, holding out the water and stuff so you can have a really good idea as to what this fish looks like uh, so we can get it home. You ready? Fast, 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 fast. Pick it up, pick it up. Okay. This is my new pet, guys. Look at this guy. Ridiculous. <laughs> Look at that guy in the lighting. He's tensing up a little bit, so. I'm gonna go ahead and put him right here in the pond. Oh, get in the car. Take a breath. Relax. Relax. Oh, yeah. That's what I like to see. I mean, there's plenty of room for this guy to grow, and wow. Just wow. Come here, buddy. You okay? Come on. Whoa, watch my hand. <laughs> see how his fins are all bit up? He's gonna be fine now. It's only his uh, pectoral fins, though. He's good. All right, come on, guys. We're gonna get that gar out. Put on my polarized glass so I can have a better, better look at him. Check it out. Sorry, did I say gar? Gar's on my mind. Come on. There he's in that corner. Check it out, check it out, check it out. Oh, oh, oh. He's fast, he's fast. Oh my God, that thing is fast. You fast freaking fish, you. All right, so we gotta get him. Oh, got him. <laughs> Not bad if I do say so myself. Check him out, check him out. Check him out, oh. Oh, that thing is gorgeous. It's not stressing him out too much. Ha ha! Ah ha ha ha! Look at the spines on that thing. I'm surprised it didn't get spiked last time. That thing is sick. Anyway, this guy is eating. He's already eaten twice. And now it's time to get that blob eat, guys. We're gonna take him over to his new enclosure. My baby, come here. Look at this guy. Focus in on that beautiful thing. Look at that. The blob. Look how its stomach is like so blobby, just like all over my fingers. All right, so now. Oh, sorry, guys. So now these temperatures are the same. He's going in. There you go, buddy. Boom. That's a lot better, don't you think so, guys? How you doing, buddy? Yeah, we can actually see you. No matter where he gulps that. Big old goldfish, whatever we feed this guy, koi, who knows what we'll feed him. But he also has some uh, where to hide, a little cave down there, and he can explore. This is a 50 gallon on this bottom and 75 on top. So guys, we're good to go. I know it hasn't been the most exciting vlog because of our tragedy, but, but it's how you come back and catch them all. It's how you make a real legend that'll never die. But guys, I'm really excited. We're gonna feed the blob really soon. The next episodes are nothing but giants. Guys, you're gonna love the episodes that we did make in Louisiana. I hope you enjoyed this episode despite what's going on, and I hope you enjoyed the future episodes and all the episodes we already made, guys. Go through, binge watch. If you know anything about our flower horn or gar, please let us know. Add me on Instagram, catch them all fishing. Maybe we'll get lucky. Copy merch, real legends never die, and catch them all. Catch them all. Catch them all.